So uh, what you need to do right now, if you want a Twitter shout out, all you got to do is just go to my Twitter account, Politics Ghost, all one word, no underscores, Politics Ghost, and retweet the tweet that states True Capitalist Radio Live. Retweet the tweet that states True Capitalist Radio Live, and I will give you a shout out live right here in the broadcast, right here and now. All right, it's as simple as that. Anyway, do we have any Twitter shout-outs there, Engineer? Hey, how was your uh, Veterans Day, Engineer? What'd you do? Well, it sounds like fun there, Engineer. Anyway, let's go ahead and get some Twitter shout-outs right now. (laughs) All right, hopefully we... uh, I mean, look, you know, I'm glad I took the whole weekend off. I I mean, it wasn't just the veterans day that I took the show off. I literally took the whole weekend off. I didn't, I didn't want to talk to anybody. I didn't want to, I I didn't want to do too much business. Uh, I needed it. I feel great. I needed one of those. I'll tell you that right now. I feel, I feel pretty good. Anyway, let's see who we have here. We got CD Wheaties in the place. Uh, we got Steinbrenner in the house, Sergeant Yoda in the place. What's going on? Uh, we got anarcho capitalist, uh, Baxter Chan in the house. What's going on, Jeff the Chef in the house? Uh, who else do we got here? Dorito Burrito. Who else do we got here? The 727 caller in the house. Go, go, gadget napalm. What the hell? Are... Jesus Christ, man. Give me a break. DHS landscape. No, no, don't even kid around about that, man. You know, because a lot of these sons of bitches in my neighborhood, they get their freaking, uh, 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 their lawns done by all, by all kinds of different companies, for Christ's sake. That's not even funny. Anyway, who else do we got here? Uh, shaking in New Zealand. No, don't do that, man. Come on, man. Don't do that. We got Governor Wolf in the house. Leonard Cohen, LOL. Uh, you know, look, I think it's sad that Leonard Cohen died, but the guy was in his 80s, man. Give me a break, all right? I mean, one of the few depressed guys that, uh, you know, lived in their 80s. So, you know what? I mean, you know, hey, you know, Leonard Cohen, you know? I mean, I mean, some of us are lucky to even get to that age, for heaven's sake. Anyway, deplorable Biff in the house. Uh, we, who else we got? We got Capitalist Kush. Uh, we got Trump's ray gun. What the hell does that mean? We got uh, Trump's wall catapult. Oh, yeah. yeah, I'm sure, boy. I'm sure. We got Jimmy Capitalist in the house. What's going on? We got ghost-funded ISIS. Uh, Shut up, man. Our government did that. Our government did that, you son of a bitch. The virtue signal. Well, great. I'm I'm sure you're very proud of yourself every time you virtue signal, huh, boy? Yeah, I bet you're one of these sons of bitches that uh, walk an old lady across the street and you make sure to let everybody know, hey, everybody, I'm walking this old hag across the street. Look at me. Look at me. I'm a good person. Look at me. Typical liberal trash, for Christ's sake. What's going on to Exara Hawks? We got the automator in the house. Who else do we have here? We got, we got the maggot muncher. I know who you are. Jesus Christ. Who else do we got here? We got r- rifle kick. Who else do we have here? Trans Matrix. Did, are you kidding me? You put a pair of balls on the Matrix? They put a pair of balls on the Matrix, for Christ's sake. Oh, my God, man. We got Cam the Man in the house. We got the Boogeyman. How you doing, man? Saw you on the, uh, I saw you on election night with that badass Gat Man. I'm telling you. Second Amendment all the way. Who else do we have here? We got uh, uh, the, the the Brony Network. Uh, Ghost is Bill Crystal. Uh, what are you, ta- are you talking about that conservative asshole that funded McMullen? Or are you talking about that asshole that always hosts the freaking Oscars, Billy Crystal? Either way, uh, no. Southern AU in the house. Uh, who else do we have here? Uh, we got a pimp named Slickback. What the hell does that mean? How does that mean? Trump deport ghost. Ah, shut up, Trump deport ghost. Are you kidding me? Let me tell you something. Hey, Donald Trump, if you're listening, I'm going to tell you something right now, all right? I know that they have literally thrown off the uh, the press corps. 
You know, they've thrown the press corps off. They, they, I mean, I'm literally, Trump is done with the lamestream mainstream media. If he needs uh, 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 somebody in the press to be following around the Donald Trump campaign while we're doing live broadcasts, right here, baby, all right? Understand? Uh, I, I am the minister of meme warfare out here. How about that, Trump? I mean, hell, did you all hear that he actually put Milo Yiannopoulos on the list of being a potential uh, press secretary? I mean, cool. I mean, I know he's trolling, but still, I mean, that's hilarious. <laughs> that's hilarious, for heaven's sake. I can only imagine the press secretary. And, and look, this, this would be the lamestream mainstream media, you know. And then they'd have to deal with this, you know, fabulous Milo. Like, oh, yes, darling, uh, Daddy is on uh, uh, immigration right now. And, uh, you know, I'm going, uh, I'm going to the pool now. And uh, I'm going to take that circus secret service agent. And uh, uh, I, I can only imagine. I know it's a troll, but still. I think it's funny, Trump. Uh, you know, much props. Anyway, uh, we got uh, uh, Magellan, I think that's your name. What's going on? Who else do we have here? Take a couple more call or take a couple more Twitter shout-outs. Excuse me. Jesus Christ. You can tell I've been off for the weekend. I've had a decent weekend. I'm a little loose. We got Norwegian capitalist in the place. What's going on? We got venison in the house. President Mike Pence, 2007. Ah, don't even. Son of a. Don't even. Don't even kid around about that, boy. Let me tell you something, you scumbag. Don't you even kid around about that, boy. Don't you dare, don't you even dare kid around about that, boy. I'm telling you that right goddamn now. Mike Pence, 2017. Let me tell you something, man. If y'all are worried about Trump and y'all do something to Trump, Mike Pence will be your worst nightmare. Are you kidding me? This guy will start doing what – you remember tr- True Conservative Radio Ghost? Remember that? He's going to make that a reality. You know what I mean? He's going he, he to make marriage illegal. You understand that? I'm ser- I'm not joking around. He's going to make marriage illegal, and he's going to overturn gay marriage. Uh, he, he's going to put the Ten Commandments back everywhere. He's going to put prayer back in school. So go ahead. Go ahead. And you think you're so goddamn cute. Think so goddamn slick. Jesus Christ, we got, listen, we're already in the second hour of the True Capitalist radio broadcast, and of course, I am your host, the man they call Ghost, and once again, I want to thank you very much for tuning in with me. If you haven't done so, please bookmark the official website of the True Capitalist radio show. It is blogtalkradio.com slash ghost. That's blogtalkradio.com slash ghost. Every one of my episodes is there to download absolutely free, folks. So, I mean, they're time dated and stamped as well. I mean, proving all the prognostications, man. Proving it. Because let me tell you something. <laughs> Everything that I've ever said was going to come to pass has come to goddamn pass, boy. Anyway, we got the grim capitalist in the house. Let's keep going with some of more. I'm only going to take a few more of these damn Twitter shout-outs here. We got the Neon Knight. What's going on to Mark Montag in the house? Who else do we got? Jesus Christ, man. I, I, I can already tell these people are trying to ruin my Monday here, I'm trying to turn this into a carpet munching Monday, and I really don't appreciate it one goddamn bit. Jesus Christ. We got the Smiler in the house. Uh, we got Obama for lame duck, duck eater. What the hell does that mean? Lame duck, I guess, but the lame duckinator, I think is what you meant to say. So, Jesus Christ. Trump rigged it, huh? Trump rigged it. Shut up, all right? Just shut your stupid face. Trump rigged it. Man, let me tell you something. Oh, uh, Hillary tried to rig it, and she couldn't do it, all right? Now, uh, who the hell knows where she is? Uh, where's Hillary Clinton now? Uh, probably in bed, resting. Huh? Hey, in bed resting. Definitely not with Bill. We got old Flamo in the house. What's going on, old Flamo? Uh, who else do we got here? I'm only going to take a couple more of these because I can see that you assholes are, you know, you're starting to piss me off, and I really don't appreciate it. Once again, you want a Twitter shout out? Go to my Twitter account right now at Politics Ghost. 
all one word, no underscores, or at politics ghost, and retweet the tweet that states True Capitalist Radio Live. True Capitalist Radio Live. If you retweet that tweet, I will give you a Twitter shout out live right here on the broadcast. Let's continue going with a couple of more, folks, because these are starting to get disgusting. I can tell you that right now. Uh, we got correct the record. Correct the record. Get the hell off my broadcast. Correct the record. That better not be correct the record. Get off my broadcast, David Brock. All right? You piece of crap. And oh, yeah. I was going through public records here recently, and guess who? Guess who? Well, you know, made an $11,000 donation to Comet Ping Pong, the infamous pizza joint in Washington, D.C., that has come under some controversy because of, you know, potential or alleged uh, pedophile implications of that goddamn location. How convenient. This circle all comes full circle, doesn't it? Oh my God, man! Anyway, let's let's. Uh, who else do we got here? Who else do we have? Who else do we have here? We got. Uh, I'm not going to say that for Christ's sake, you stupid loser. We got Supa in the house. What's going on, Supa? Jesus Christ, man! We got. Hey, what's going on to Distilling? How you doing, man? What's going on to Aussie Capitalist as well? Uh, what's going on to all the Australian fans? We got a lot of Australian fans uh, out there in Australia, New Zealand. As a matter of fact, uh, uh, prayers to New Zealand. Serious earthquakes going on out there. Uh, stay safe, everybody, man. And uh, you know, Jesus Christ, I don't know what to say, man. That, that, that's some really serious stuff going on out there. We got Doctor Bristle in the house. Uh, we got uh, Tub Guy in the house. We got TC Capitalist. Uh, we got, uh, Applejack for Trump. What the hell does that mean? Uh, you're talking about a pony or something. God, Jesus Christ, man. Shut up. Who else do we have here? We got, uh, what's going on in Alberto? How you doing, man? Uh, we got Waste of Life Ghost. Oh, yeah. All right. Why don't you come up to me, you asshole, and say that to me? I guarantee you, your little pipsqueak internet tough guy ass wouldn't say that to my face. I guarantee goddamn tea, you boy. I kicked the living crap out of you. What's going on to William Handley? Uh, what's going on to the Green Bio? Uh, Ghost's wheelchair. Look, I am not a cripple, all right? And even if I was, there's nothing wrong with it, all right? All right, I mean, I've showed you time and time again I can do for Lorico. So, you know, shove it up your ass with all that wheelchair stuff, all right? Jesus Christ. Anyway, who else do we got going on here? Uh, I'm only going to take a couple more. These are just stupid, for Christ's sake. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Ghost is Lord Hater. Huh? I'm a hater now. I got more haters than Haterade, but I'm the hater. Is that it? I got more haters than Haterade, but I'm the goddamn it. Shove it up your ass. We got AL the Game Freak. What's going on? We got CDI fan. Podesta the Molesta. <laughs> That was pretty funny. Uh, Ronald McDonald Trump. What the hell does that mean? What the hell does that mean? Uh, who else do we have here? Uh, we've got, I'm not saying these disgusted names for Christ's sake. I'm serious. You people are getting disgusting with this, and I don't even know why. I, I mean, you guys are sick in the heads. You've got to know this at this point in time. You damn Internet troll idiots are sick in the head. Look at this. Crackhead Cuckery. You know, that, 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 that's a name. That's a freaking name, for Christ's sake, man. Jesus Christ. Uh, Ghost's Wife Autograph. Look, st- enough of that. Stop. Stop it. Stop asking for my wife's autograph. Jesus. I'm serious, man. Stop asking for my wife's autograph, for Christ's sake. Jesus Christ. Why would you even want my wife's autograph, for Christ's sake, you sick sons of bitches? Want my wife's autograph. Shove it up your ass. All right, seriously, shove it up your ass. <sighs> Jesus Christ, man. Who else do we have? We got Zim Tower in the house. Uh, we've got uh, Wet Kiwis for Go. Ah, oh, you son of a. <laughs> Damn it! All right, you know, I've had enough of this, man. I'm not going to let you idiots sit here 
and, and make a, a mockery out of a serious tragedy, a natural disaster that has happened uh, to the country of New Zealand. I have a lot of people who listen to me. I, I have a lot of people who listen to me from New Zealand, and I don't appreciate you people sitting there talking that garbage about it. You understand that, boy? But give me a damn break. Give me the mouth. Let me tell you something, man. I, I'm not. I, I can't believe it. I can't believe it, man. I cannot believe it. Ugh. Look, I, I, I'm done with these Twitter shout-outs today. I can I can tell you idiots that you you know you people. You know what I mean? You goddamn people. I'm telling you. Anyway, folks, look, I'm sorry. I need a drink after that. And look, the only reason I do Twitter shout-outs is an attempt to try to make the show interactive. You know what I'm saying? But this is the kind of crap that you get. No respect. No respect. Anyway, folks, let's go ahead and get to everybody's favorite part of the broadcast, all right? All right, I'm talking about Radio Graffiti! <laughs> That's right, folks. Radio graffiti, a part of the broadcast where the spectators become a part of the spectacle. All you've got to do is give me a call right now at 425-390-6146. And when I call on your area code or on, well, you don't have Skype anymore. So when I call on your area code, you've got exactly three to four seconds to say whatever it is that's on your mind. That's why we call this. Radio Graffiti, all right? Anyway, folks, uh, do we have any uh, callers, engineer? (laughs) All right, well, let's go ahead and get to some Radio Graffiti callers right now. (laughs) Anyway, folks, uh, what do we got here? Let's go ahead and get some callers here, see what we got. How about uh, anonymous Radio Graffiti? Okay, great. Helen Keller, deaf mute, right off the top. All right, how about anonymous radio graffiti? Crazy radio graffiti. I had mask pony here in a diaper. Do you want to go ahead and take off your diaper? Mask pony. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. You know how people are eating condiments? <laughs> Man, you sick son of a bitch. That's sick. That's sick crap. What? What the hell kind of sick crap is that? Man, you know, I'm telling you, you goddamn trolls get sicker and sicker and sicker, man. Jesus Christ, man. And I know that music, too, ass cracks, all right? I know where that sick ass crap comes from. That's gross. You're sick. You're sick. Give me the freaking. Give me the. Give me the goddamn mic for heaven's sake, man. I'm telling you, man, you guys are sick puppies, man. You need your freaking heads examined, all of you, seriously. I mean, I'd, I'd like to, you know, ha- have an examination of your frontal cortex because I think there's, there's some freaking tumor going on and and, and at least a good half of you sons of bitches. Jesus Christ. Or a calcified uh, pineal gland or something. Jesus Christ. How about 267 radio graffiti? Jesus Christ, here we go again. Helen Keller deaf mutes. How about anonymous radio graffiti? I mean, well, what is this? I mean, does, does not does nobody want to do radio graffiti? Huh? Does nobody want to do radio graffiti? I mean, should I sing some carols or something? Should I sing some uh, songs? Huh? Is that what I is that what I should do? I mean, nobody wants to. I mean, I I mean, give me a break. I mean, what the hell? I'm not taking calls. Let you say something, you stupid piece of crap. 
Anonymous, read your goddamn graffiti. Yeah, all right, great. Yeah, okay, we get it. It's the nut shack. Real funny idiots. Anonymous, radio graffiti. <laughs> Hey, hey, shut that, shut that off, you stupid moron. Jesus Christ. How about 831 Radio Graffiti? So I'm glad you called on me before it ensues into chaos, but um, I actually wanted to talk on what you kind of said near the end. Yeah, I was talking to some, uh, I mean, I'm 23, so this guy was, like, roughly around my age, and I was talking to him about, like, actual, like, the discrimination and, like, the history of feminism, and, like, I got halfway in, and he's, like, shut me down. He's, like, Oh, this is a little over my head. Um, anyway, I was over at the feminist uh, booth at school getting all these phone numbers, and he, he just got back to talk to himself. It was like an hour with this guy, and it kept going back to that. So, yeah, totally, that, that is a thing. And I am a millennial, and unfortunately, yeah, that, that is something that a lot of us do. So, yeah. No, you're absolutely correct. I'm, I'm glad that you actually admitted, sir. I'm getting tired of these millennials as well. They're a bunch of um, narcissistic losers, man. It'd be a different story if, if if we found a young kid that's, like, narcissistic but had some skills and, uh, I don't know, was making money or was a protege or was Doogie Hauser or something. Something. These kids are losers, man, on top of which – uh, they're man children. I, I, look, I don't want to get into it, man. Jesus Christ. Everybody knows my freaking view on this. Uh, how about Anonymous Radio Graffiti? Night Prowler Radio Graffiti. Yes! 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 I freaking love having some goddamn uh, butt plugs up my ass. <laughs> 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 Woo! <laughs> <laughs> you goddamn son of a Okay, they're splicing my voice into this sick, disgusting garbage. And look, this is what the, this is what radio graffiti has turned out to be. And you know, I don't get it. Why is it? Why do you all try to like besmirch me? Uh, you kid around about me dead? Uh, yeah, I mean, well, why? Why? Why do I even try? Good God, man. Freaking carpet munching Monday. Anonymous radio graffiti. Dark sword radio graffiti. All good things come from Africa. You know, there you go with this racist music, for Christ's sake. Jesus Christ. Look, I want to let everybody know I am not a racist. I am a melting pot of friendship, for Christ's sake. I don't know how many times i got to say this across the Internet. All right? I am a melting pot of friendship. I happen to have a whole bunch of friends that happen to be black. I happen to have a whole bunch of friends that happen to be Hispandex. I happen to have a whole bunch of friends that happen to be WAP, Kraut, Muck, Shovel, and Mick. Limey, Frog, a Camel Jockey, uh, Oriental, uh, a Kangaroo Banger. I mean, I'm a melting pot of friendship for you assholes to sit here and say that I'm some kind of a goddamn racist. is a false indictment, and anybody who knows me knows it. Jesus Christ. Anonymous Radio Graffiti. Scarlet Moon Radio Graffiti. Adolf Ghostler. White power, white power, white power, white power. Go white, go white, go white, go white right now. Shut up. 
up, all right? Jesus Christ, shut up. I just finished saying I was a melting pot of friendship, asshole. And here you got to go pull this crap. Good God. Who else do we have here? How about 818 Radio Graffiti? Hey, Ghost, this is the California call from earlier. I just wanted to say thank you for having me on the show. Uh, and uh, I'd like to give a shout out, if you don't mind. Go ahead. Uh, well, all right. I'd like to give a shout out to you, the engineer the uh, Capitalist Army, and a couple of friends of mine, uh, Willie and um, uh, Strumpet. All right, man. Well, it's good to hear from you. Thank you once again for uh, taking part, and uh, hope uh, you keep listening, man. Uh, who else do we got here? Uh, anonymous Radio Graffiti. <laughs> You're bitching nigger and just let things be. You're messing up big time, take it from me. Quit your bitching nigger or you'll get your due. All the Ku Klux Klan look on my calling on you. No, get that, get that racist crap out of here. Where do you trolls find this racist crap? I'm serious, where the hell do you trolls find this racist horse crap? Good God, who else do we have here for heaven's sake? Man, I'm telling you, what a bunch of milky liquors we got going on over here. How about anonymous radio graffiti? Been raising all hell, and niggers that ain't enough. We're all getting mighty fed up with you and all of your civil rights stuff. Don't you love this country? Either you do or you don't. Uh, man, uh, look, I, look, I am uh, enough of the damn racist crap. Seriously. Enough of the shit-kicking racist music, man. Good God, how about Anonymous Radio Graffiti? Y'all listen closely. Here's a little lesson in trickery. To live the story down in history. If you want to be a villain number one, you have to chase a superhero on the run. <laughs> All right, get, get him. Get him off. Get him off, for Christ's sake. Good God, man. What's going on here, for heaven's sake, man? What's going on here? How about anonymous radio graffiti? Yeah, you're taking you're taking too long, you stupid milky liquor. How about nine one nine ready graffiti? And all you assholes that say that I'm racist, hey, it's the truth. <laughs> That's right, folks. Hey, and I, I I never said that. That's a splice. I never said that. Uh, I can't believe you idiots take the time to do this garbage. I, I just can't believe it, man. You, ta- I can't believe you put this much energy into this crap. What the hell kind of sick ass crap did I was? What the hell was that crap? Man, that's that just sounded disgusting, man. You people are freaks. Anonymous radio graffiti. Prankster Pinky Pie radio graffiti. Hey, I'm horny for Prankster Pinky Pie's penis. This is an art piece. Oh, you touched my ta la la. Man, you know, you, you need to take about ten steps away from my freaking butt crack with that crap, bro. All right, seriously. I mean, give me a freaking break with these fruit bowls. Jesus. I mean, good Lord, man. What the hell? What the hell? Anonymous Radio Graffiti. Hey, 
could get that crap. Was that the national anthem saying, Hillary, Hillary? Are you shitting me? I'm telling you, you sorry sacks of crap are turning this into a goddamn carpet munching Monday. You're turning this son of a bitch into a carpet munching Monday. I really don't appreciate it whatsoever. I, I don't appreciate it, boy. Good God, man. Ah, Jesus Christ, man. Good God. And hold, hold on just a second. Give, give, give me the mic. Give me the mic. Give me the mic. Anyway, I'm I'm sorry, folks. I'm sorry. Anyway, let's go. Let's get back to Radio Graffiti. We only got a little bit of time left. How about 309 Radio Graffiti? Hey, Ghost, how you doing, this, Jimmy? Hey, what's going on, Jimmy Capitalist man? How you doing today? I'm not doing too bad, man. I'm just uh, writing my Christmas list to Santa Claus here. I'm just wondering what you're getting for Christmas, man. No, man, I don't ever get anything for Christmas. Although I do, I can't admit though, one of the Inner Circle members is. Is giving me uh, an awesome gift. I, and look, I, he, he doesn't have to do this. He's doing it out of the kindness of his heart. I'm not necessarily saying what it is, uh, but uh, I, I have to say I'm floored. I'm floored by it. But uh, other than that, I'm not. Get, I never get anything for Christmas. Well, uh, man, you know, if you set up a PO box, I might send you, you know, a little bit of a personal gift. You know, wink, wink, if you fancy it. A personal gift. No, I don't. I don't like how that sounds. I mean, this is this is involved like bodily fluids or something. Uh, well, you know, I was talking to you the other night about something made out of rubber. So, and you mentioned bodily fluids. You know, you might like the sound of that if I send you something to people. But, uh, you know. uh, no, 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 Jimmy, don't, no. And you know what, Jimmy? What, why are you doing this? Is it because you might? I mean, can, can I can I can I say what what happened with you, you know, and, and the situation you may be in, Jimmy? Uh, <laughs> we'll wait another week and I'll let that out. All right, all right. Well, hey, thanks a lot. I don't know about your bodily fluids, Jimmy. From what I understand, they're quite fertile. All right, so uh, you know, keep keep that away from me. All right. Thank you for calling, Jimmy. Once again, Jimmy Capitalist, member of the Capitalist Army Inner Circle. Uh, a little bit kooky today, uh, you know. Maybe we'll maybe we'll wait a week and hopefully, uh, hopefully we can say what uh, what the inner circle knows about uh, Jimmy's situation. Anyway, let's get back to radio graffiti calls, folks. Uh, how about eight three two radio graffiti? Hello, girls. This is Dermot the Geek here, and I was wondering if you want to role play as two masked ponies with me. You see, we would both be wearing diapers, and I would lie on my back. Then you would take my diapers off and make my asshole clean. Uh, just shut up! Shut up! Shut up, you gay ass frog! Shut up! Sick, twisted prick! Another <laughs> 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 Jesus Christ, you could have you could have turned that down a little bit. You probably ear raped a couple of people. Six five one radio graffiti. <laughs> Okay, what was that? Was that the new Horny the Clown or something? What the hell was that? Jesus Christ. How about 210 Radio Graffiti? Hey, Ghost, it's Frosty. I'm just glad to hear you. I'm glad to be back in the States and super excited to see that Trump's in office. But Yeah, as a matter of fact, I knew you were on vacation and sorry to hear about what happened. Uh, but uh, hey, Trump's in office. It's it's a it's a new day. What were you gonna say? Go ahead. Oh no, it's fine. Um, actually, I do have an interview set up for me on Thursday, so no spilt milk. Honestly, it's all good. Uh, do you mind if I say what happened to you over the air here? Yeah, no, that's perfectly fine. Well, let, let me explain what happened to Frosty. Uh, she went on vacation, you know, and uh, she went on a cruise. And her job, uh, apparently, not only did they lay her off on her vacation, but they basically told her over the voicemail, you know, which is one of the most rowdiest things I've ever heard in my life. So, you know, once, you know, Frosty comes back after, was it a decent vacation? Was it a good vacation, Frosty? Oh, yeah, it was great. We at least bought probably five to six bottles of liquor, (laughs) 
and we went to Coast and Jamaica and Grand Cayman. It was amazing. Well, that's good. You know, after coming back from a from a bomb ass vacation, she comes home, hears the voicemail, and she's laid off. I mean, that's just horrible. That's just disgusting. And uh, but it's good to see that you're not just uh, waiting around, hoping things happen, and you're making things happen like a capitalist does. And I and I commend you for it. You're not just sitting around. Oh no, definitely. I just gotta keep. If I want to keep the lifestyle I have, I need to just keep working, just keep at it, and that's what I intend to do. I hear you. You want to give some shout-outs, Frosty? Oh, yeah. Shout-outs to you, shout-outs to the engineer, and shout-outs to everybody in the Capitol Army. Hey, thank you very much, Frosty, and good luck to you. And uh, let me tell you, I think that you're going to get yourself a gig, no problem, probably better than the one that you had last time. And keep capitalizing, all right? Keep capitalizing. How about Anonymous Radio Graffiti? We got J-Man Capitalist and Benito Gostini. Long live Donald Trump. And long live the ideas that that man said in the Communist Manifesto. Okay? The workers of the world unite. Son of a bitch. here and then I'm getting the hell out of here seriously I mean come on man come on Jesus Christ how about 614 radio goddamn graffiti if anyone needs a date head outside the immigration office after January and offer people green cards just don't put a bean in her burrito oven oh my oh man what are you what are you talking about that's horrible that's horrible tough guy I didn't know you're a racist for Christ's sake I didn't realize Tug Guy was racing. Good God, man. Jesus Christ. Uh, yeah, who else do we have? We got, we got Anonymous Radio Graffiti. It's Willie Atkins Radio Graffiti. I, I don't get it. That I, I don't. What, I, what the hell was that supposed to be? What in the hell was that supposed to be? How about two one three radio graffiti? White man, there's no need to feel down. I said, white man, pick yourself off the ground. I said, white man, cause at least you are not brown. There's no need to be a happy white man. You should wear this white robe. I said. White man. There is a uh, you know, all right, yeah, yeah. We get it, Moon Man. <laughs> I've had about enough of this crap. All right, seriously. I've had about enough. You idiots turn this into a carpet munch in Monday. Go screw yourselves, all right? If you're laughing, if you're feeling funny in the pants, go shove it up your ass. Jesus Christ. Look, I'm gonna come back tomorrow, all right, for a taco Tuesday. Hopefully everything will be a little bit better. All right, blogtalkradio.com slash ghost is the official website. And, of course, if you have not done so, follow me on Twitter, folks. The Twitter name to follow is Politics Ghost. All one word, no underscores, folks. Politics Ghost is the name to follow. Once again, folks, I will be here tomorrow for Taco Tuesday. I hope that you're here. We're here every Monday through Friday, 4 p.m. Central Standard Time, live, blogtalkradio.com slash ghost. Long live the capitalist army and death to feminism, death to socialism, death to communism, and death, death, death to totalitarianism. <laughs>